Hi everyone and welcome back to another tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can get and install live wallpapers for your PC or laptop. This is a free method that you can use, and these live wallpapers look really cool on your computer. A live wallpaper for your desktop is essentially a little video that plays on repeat, and it makes your desktop look much better. It's pretty easy to get these live wallpapers, so just make sure to watch the tutorial until the end. And before we start, if you are new here, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this in the future. It would really help out the channel. So the first step that we will do is to go and create a new folder on our desktop where we are going to put our live wallpapers later. So I'm going to name this folder live wallpaper and put it on the right side of my screen. The next step is to open any web browser on your PC and go to google.com. In Google, you need to type desktop live wallpapers. Now in the search results, we want to open this link from Microsoft's official website. I'll leave a link of this site in the description of the video so you can open it from there. When we open the site, it's going to open the app that we need to install before we install our live wallpapers. The app's name is Desktop Live Wallpapers as you can see, and the color of the icon is purple. So make sure that you install the specific app. Click on Get, and then open Microsoft Store. After that it's gonna open this window here, and you just need to install the app. Wait a couple of minutes until this app installs, and after this we can go to the next step. First let's check out the app. So I'm going to open it, and the app should look something like this. It's a pretty simple design, and we will import our live wallpapers here in order to install them and use them on our desktop. Now let's get our live wallpapers and install them on our PC. You want to go back to Google and then type Live Wallpaper Windows 10. And you are going to get a bunch of websites in the search results where you can get really cool live wallpapers, but the site which I use is called My Live Wallpapers. I'll leave a link of that website in the description also so you can go and check out what they have. When you open the site, it looks a little something like this. You have thousands of wallpapers to choose from, and you can also choose a specific themes right here. I'm going to select this nature one because I like those kinds of wallpapers. And when I select one from the list, it will open up a little video preview so I can see how the live wallpaper looks like. And if you want to download it, just scroll down and you are going to see download buttons. I'm going to download this one and then put this wallpaper in my folder. And the next step is a very important one, so you need to follow my steps. We have to convert this video into a WMV format, since we are using the free version of the Live Wallpaper app, it only supports this format. You can upgrade to a pro account, and that's going to cost you a couple of dollars. But if you want the free version, then we must convert our file. We need to go to our web browser, and then go to a website that's called Cloud Convert. This is a great website for converting our files. When you open the site, click on Select File, and then find the wallpaper, or video we've just downloaded. Then click on the arrow right here, and select WMV. This process lasts only a minute or two, and after that our MP4 video will be converted to WMV, and we will be able to install the wallpaper to our desktop. When the file converts, download it to your PC and put it in your live wallpapers folder. When we finish with these steps, we simply need to open our app, and then choose our folder. And here are our wallpapers. As you can see, we can't select the MP4 video because the free version doesn't support it, but we can select our converted file, and the live wallpaper will be set on our desktop. That is how you can get live wallpapers on Windows 10. If this tutorial was helpful, then leave a like on this video and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.